What happened? Oh. Let me see. Today we're finally going to get on that uh, 1980 VW uh, Caddy. We're going to remove the tank. We're going to flush it out. And right now we're heading over to O'Reilly's. We're going to pick up a fuel filter. And we're going to uh, put in a new fuel filter. And hopefully today we'll be able to get that engine running. So follow us as we go. guys uh, finally got the caddy open up and everything we uh, <clears throat> we put a little bit more support underneath uh, worked on that so today we also got the uh, from O'Reilly's we got the filter we're gonna replace and we're gonna uh, remove the hose here and we're also gonna flush uh, out everything through the hose but the main part is that we need to get under here okay so what we're gonna start is we're gonna take this out we're gonna use a, a Phillips, uh, no, let's say a flathead screwdriver. We're gonna move this pipe. We got the bowl right here. We're gonna drain it out. While I do that, um, Ricky, I need you, I need you to break loose these these two screws. I believe a a 12 deep socket screws or uh, break these loose. So uh, surely gotta be kidding me. No, we have to re remove these tank the thing to drain the the, the tank. And uh, and please don't call me Shirley. Smell sensation, man, this thing stinks. Looks like there's even uh, water, water in the fuel as well. All right, let's go for a second batch. completely emptied out uh, I'm gonna go in the front of the engine bay and I'm gonna remove the pipe and, and I have the air compressor and we're just gonna blow some to it. so Ricky what I need you to do is I need you to hold this right here and just tell me let us know uh, you know if anything does come out okay so you ready mm -hmm. all right let me go up front and we're gonna drain this out 
All right, I got the air hose all set up right here. Everything's ready to go. There's a tool to break, break this loose. Come on. All right. washers now we're ready I even changed the tip here to the hose here change the tip Rick are you ready down there yeah. all right here we go we're gonna send some air into the system here and hopefully all right here I go right. anything come out yeah. huh yeah what? What happened? Oh. Let me see. Did it, did you get it in your eye? No. <laughs> oh man. Well, at least we got the gunk. Oh. Uh. What happened? <laughs> show, show the the viewers. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, at least we got the gunk out of the pipe. So next step is just to uh, put the hose back in place and. Uh, <laughs> Oh my goodness, man, you are watch covered. <laughs> All right. Well, I pressure wash is nice and clean now, and uh, uh, having a visual inspection of it, uh, everything's good, there's no rust or anything. So to better uh, flush out this tank, I'm thinking of taking this, uh, this meter, uh, the measuring uh, level, the, the, the level of fuel level gauge, and I'm gonna take this out real quick and hopefully one. Well, oh, here we go. We're gonna clean this up and hopefully we can remove a lot of the gunk and a lot of the uh, debris and everything out, out through here. Yeah. Yep, we got work to do. some of the solvents and uh, clean it up a little bit better so let's try that all right I cleaned it off and everything uh, this is pretty much as best as I can I, I added a little bit of oil here to make sure this is nice and lubricated protected so you know, avoid uh, rusting any further than what it is already. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and replace this back in here. I like to add a little bit of silicone just to get a nice uh, sealed shut. as uh, much as we can, uh, I figured let's just uh, put it back. Gotta fill up the uh, fuel pump, fuel filter.
as you can see, Ricky is in here. He's got his face cleaned up for a kid got all through. <laughs> that was funny. But see, what I'm saying, this is this is a small truck, man. Look at this. Even my 15-year-old can't fit in this thing. He says it's comfortable, but I don't know. Try try doing a, a wild job, but it's crazy. We, as you saw, we are able to flush the uh, to the tank. We cleaned it out and everything else. We got it real nice and clean. We also uh, installed a new filter. The new filter is in place right here. So we got the new filter. We got the pipes uh, cleaned out. The tubes all cleaned out. We also primed the pump. Everything is ready to go. And we also installed a new battery. We're gonna just uh, fully charge it and everything else, but we got a new battery. Now the question is, will it start? Unfortunately, we're out of time. So next week, we'll find out if we're able to start this engine or not. So join us next week as we, uh, as we get that going.